What is going on guys? Gray here. Today I'd like to talk about the new companions we're going to get in the Elder Scrolls Online this summer with the High Isles chapter. And one of these companions is actually going to be what the community has been asking for. A companion that will allow you to steal, pickpocket, really without losing rapport. A, a companion that actually likes those kind of things. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description. The community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel empire jerky and amazon associates also check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well and be sure if you're not su subscribed to the channel go ahead and hit that sub button and if you enjoy the video hit the like button that really helps me out a lot now when it comes to companions of course i've talked about this a lot in past videos some players really like them some players don't really care for companions they may be pvp fans so they don't really use them so when it comes to new companions it's kind of a, a, a mixed bag of feelings in the community in general but one thing that I, I think a lot of us can agree on, if you like companions or not, there was one type of companion that was needed in game, and that was a companion that would actually allow you to do things in the game that they you may not consider as moral as other things you could do. So we're going to get we're going to get a new companion called Ember, which is a Khajiit, which has grown up on the streets and has more of a wild, carefree attitude. She has loose morals and may enjoy it when players steal and pickpocket. She also is a mage who prefers to use magic over brute force or stealth. Now, we're not quite sure what... I, I, what I'm really interested in is we're not quite sure what her things are going to, um, I guess, make her rapport go down. If she al allows you or likes you to steal and pickpocket and is not really a fan of stealth, if you're using stealth, is that going to be the thing that she doesn't like? I, I would not assume that would be the case considering she likes pickpocketing and stealing. If you're doing more moral things, like things that you would do that actually are good in the game, is that going to bring her rapport down? I'm really interested to see exactly how that's going to work with her. And then, of course, the other companion we're going to get is kind of like what we already have in game. And I was kind of disappointed to see exactly what Isabel was going to do. But Isabel is an expiring knight who has more of an honorable and noble outlook on life. She prefers to seek out justice and do good in the world. It says players who stick to the straight and narrow path may want to keep her around. Now, that really kind of, like I said, sounds like what we already have available in-game. And I was really hoping that they were going to allow us to have two new companions that weren't really like what we already had. Um, I, I think most people, if you're a companion fan, you're going to go probably level up to new Khajiit first. Uh, Ember is going to be the one that a lot of people want. Because if you're out wanting to loot uh, containers, steal things, pickpocket in the new zone, you know, trying to find recipes and trying to find furnishing recipes, food recipes, whatever the case may be, you're definitely going to have Ember out because she's actually going to allow you to steal and not really lose a lot of rapport. Now, when it comes to Isabel, I just feel like Isabel is going to be the exact same thing we already have, unless they have changed her up enough to where she is on the really straight and narrow path to where if you do anything wrong whatsoever, it's going to affect the, the rapport with her. That could be the case. But I was really hoping Zoss would give us two new companions that are completely different than what we already have. And I see that being an issue going forward. If they continue to add companions in the game, of course, we only got two last year, two this year. And I'm assuming that's probably all we're going to get. And they may go away from the companion system after this year. Who knows? Because they do like to change it up every couple of years, what the, new, what the new things are they're bringing to the game. But you're eventually going to run into the issue of your companions are going to have the same things that, you know, make them gain or lose rapport. You're never really going to be able to make those different too much, you know, going forward if you have so many companions just in general in the game. So let's say if you have 10 companions, majority of them are going to be alike. I guess you can give them different personalities and things like that. But overall, I think a lot of players, like I said, are going to be really happy to finally get a companion that's going to allow us to steal and pickpocket really without losing that rapport and having to put your companion away when you're, when you're deciding to go do those things. Because most players in the Elder Scrolls Online decide to do that kind of stuff. Now, if Isabel is some kind of companion where they're going to change how the the whole justice system works in the game, which a lot of people have talked about uh, in the past, they're like an update to the justice system to be more of a good and bad style characters. Isabel might be something that would be really interesting to use. We'll kind of have to wait and see as we get more information about the new companions. But leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about these new companions. Let me know if you are happy to finally have a companion that's going to let you do more evil kind of things in the game. Now, I did not say it would be fine with uh you know with ember if you go out and murder npcs we'll kind of have to wait and see on that i know a lot of people like to do that kind of stuff as well so for some of the achievements and things in game so we'll kind of have to wait and see how bad actually ember will let you be uh in the game in general but leave me a comment with your thoughts of course if you liked it hit the like if you hadn't subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace